name is Bradley. I'm a nurse. The kidneys are an area, pair of organs, each about the size of an average fist, on either side of your spine. Kidneys purify your blood by removing waste and excess fluid when your kidneys don't work properly. The process called dialysis is used to perform the function on your kidneys. But when do you need dialysis? Hey Paco, come tell them over here why we need dialysis. Dialysis is needed when you develop end-stage kidney failure. Usually by the time you lose about 85% to 90% of your kidney function and have a glomecular filtration rate lower than 15. But what does dialysis really do, Bradley? Well, when your kidneys fail, your body keeps your body in balance by doing removing waste, salt, and extra water to prevent them from building up in the body and keeping a safe level of certain chemicals in your body and helps control your blood pressure. Kidney failure is usually permanent, but not in all cases. Some kinds of kidney failure can be better with treatment, but most of the time, you will need dialysis. Some people are able to apply for new kidney as well. Dialysis can be done in a hospital or at home. You can decide with a doctor what works best. The two types of dialysis are hemodialysis and peritoneal. Hemodialysis uses a machine called an artificial kidney. A patient goes through to a clinic for treatments multiple times a week. Peritoneal dialysis uses the lining of your abdomen called a peritoneal membrane to filter your blood. Even with the different types of dialysis treatments, you still will be put on some medication prescribed to you by your doc. It is also possible to live a normal life even with dialysis. You can try to get to a normal lifestyle as you can, but you don't don't plan on having children. Unfortunately, because of the condition of your kidneys, you can have a higher level of waste products in the body compared to a woman with regular kidneys. It's, if somehow you are able to become pregnant, you will require more dialysis treatment during your pregnancy. Hey Paco, ever wonder if you could have possibly have kidney failure? Some symptoms that might occur if your body is experiencing kidney failure are fatigue, frequent need to urinate, itchy skin, nausea, shortness of breath, water retention, blood in the urine. What if someone was experiencing these symptoms and they found out they had kidney failure? How do you prepare for dialysis? Well, Paco, before any real treatment, your doctor with using surgery to implant either a tube or a device to get access to your bloodstream. And you wouldn't have to worry. This operation is a very quick procedure. You would could go home the same day. Okay, but what is the outcome in the long run with my treatment? Thankfully, not all kidney disorders are permanent. Dialysis can be temporary and it can solve the function of your kidneys until your kidneys repair themselves and work on their own. But if you have chronic kidney disease, your kidneys rarely get better and you will need dialysis permanently. Oh no. Or request kidney treatment. In a hypertonic situation, more waste is outside the cell compared to inside the cell. So the cell shrinks while in a hypotonic situation, more waste is outside the cell, so the cell is filled, which could possibly cause the cell to burst. Dialysis helps get patients to an isotonic state in which the cell waste concentration is the same in and out of the cell. I hope everyone learned an abundance of information on dialysis. Thank you!